Yes. Yeah. Um, I just want to say that the staff has been amazing. Phenomenal, I think would be a better word. Phenomenal. Phenomenal. Yes, and the care is unrelenting. They put their all into it. How many friends have you made while you've How been here? How many friends have I made while I've been here? <laughs> oh, more than I can count. <laughs> so it must be more than five then. Okay, oh, hey, watch <laughs> it. Uh, I guess it's getting a little long now, but yeah, um, okay. we'll make another one when I'm released. Oh, that's the, that's the main update I was looking for, I forgot. Mom, when do you get to go home with me? Tonight. What? This afternoon. Wasn't it tomorrow originally that they said was, yesterday? Yes, it was supposed to be Wednesday. Dig this. Way to go to recoup fast. Get this. The doctor came in to talk to me after uh, looking at my x-rays and doing a comparative analysis between when I was admitted the first night, Friday, in the ER. ER and to mask it to the one that they took this morning, another very sweet young lady. Anyway, so he sat down and he's telling me, you know, that he compared the two and all of this and from the looks of how much better I'm doing and how little infection is left. The, the, the antibiotics that have been going in, not leaving my IV, have done so good that I could go home tonight or tomorrow. And it didn't hit me at first what he said about tonight or tomorrow. I looked at and I did a double take. I said, What? Because he's sitting in the chair right across from me. I can go home tonight. He goes, If you want to, well, you can stay. I said, no, no, no. I'm You're like, Oh, tonight. yeah, let's stay. <laughs> he said, But there were a few requirements I had to do as far as I get to talking to my oxygen goes down, which is bad for my heart. I keep trying to remind her, breathe, don't talk so much, but oh, yeah. she has a lot she wants to say, I and do. that's fine. So that's this fine. one's I'll carry on. Okay. Uh, there were some breathing requirements I had to meet. Wait, why do you stop and take a breath? Just, okay. just take you, a breath. You tell the rest of the story, Cat Walker. No, it, just take your time, take a breath. <sighs> this has been my job for the last five days. My mom is shh, just breathe. I do get excited. Breathe for a second. <laughs> she gets excited, exactly. See? Okay, are you better? I don't know my numbers. That's yeah, they off. took they took that off. But anyway, all right, go ahead. Um, so I had to do a few things as far as my oxygen level, my two saturation. Um, it does look like I will have to have um, oxygen from now on. No, off and on. I was gonna say not constantly. Not it's constant. just for the foreseeable future until you're better. Right. It's all about you. And I have a little machine here. Oh yeah, are they sending that home with you? This is mine. It's a, it's a, it's like exercising your arm muscles or any other muscle. It is to exercise and inflate my lungs into the deeper recesses. You want to show them how you use it? I can show you. Oh, they raised me. She raised my level this morning. Julie raised my level. Oh. Now this one I cannot, I cannot keep this little ball. Up in the the zone. indicator. I cannot keep that up here, but I can get this one tall. Okay, so what you do? Take a, take a good breath first. I have to breathe. Hang on. She's been out of breath and unable to talk for the past five days very much. So now so, when I, a lot of text. so now she's very talkative. Yes. So just bear with okay. us for a sec. So what I do first, I exhale, and then I'm going to inhale, and this will rise. A lot of you may already know this machine. But it's my lung exerciser. So, okay. So, see where you are. Okay, hang on. Don't worry. Hey. What's the thing, Mom? Ignore me. Ignore me. Go, 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 go. I beat my record. What did you reach? I reached up here. Oh, nice. I got. I beat my record. Nice. Knuckles. Yay! But that's how you do it. Alright, we're actually okay. reaching nine minutes. Quickly say bye. I'm actually supposed to I'm actually supposed to do it four or five times an hour, not a day, an hour. So right. okay. So I'm not sure if I can post a ten minute video, so I'm gonna okay. to listen to two videos. Okay, you might have to. But anyway, <laughs> it's a lot of information. Just wanted to let you all know. Thank you for your prayers, your care and concern and I appreciate it. Well, what do you got? No, it's okay. 
Don't cry. You missed this entire video. It's okay. Okay. It's okay, Mom. Why do you pizza blessings? Okay. <laughs> it's okay, Mom. Bush people of Alaska, how is Amy Brown doing following her hospital stay? Star of Alaskan Bush people Amy Brown provided an update on her health after being admitted to the hospital in the middle of March. The Discovery Channel matriarch's daughter, Snowbird Brown, initially broke the story, claiming that she had trouble breathing. Amy Brown had a cold that progressed to pneumonia, both Snowbird and her mother fell ill. But at first, they assumed it was just a terrible cold that was circulating through Washington. The family were concerned when she began to have breathing difficulties and sent her to the emergency room. Bear Brown, her son, informed his followers that physicians had diagnosed her with pneumonia following her admittance. The Discovery Channel star assured his fans that his mom would be okay because Amy Brown's a fighter. Well, he was right and the 60-year-old mama of the wolf pack soon went back home. However, some of her Alaskan Bush People fans felt alarmed because she updated them about her health by taking a walk in a snowstorm. How does the Alaskan Bush People star doing now? When the grandmother walked in the snow, her breath was very raspy and she huffed and puffed a lot. Well, her latest update on Instagram revealed her walking again this time, it wasn't snowing, but she mentioned that rain might be imminent. High up in the mountains, she said that is very chilly lower down. Amy Brown titled her reel as Wilderness Walk, but she'd forgotten to charge her phone battery, so she had to cut filming her adventures short. The Discovery Channel star showed her followers where she'd sat down to rest a bit. Fortunately, she looks and sounds fully recovered from her pneumonia. Alaskan Bush People fans were happy to see her in good health. However, some people cautioned her in the comments. Good to see you walking in the woods, please be safe bears are coming out with their babies and cougars are always roaming around, so please pack protection with you since you're sick walking alone, take care I love you. Watch for rattlesnakes, they are coming out. Hello Amy, looking fabulous, God's handiwork, just beautiful. Amora so good to see you out and about on your daily hike. Hope you enjoy your day today and have a great night tonight. I have always adored you, watched every season. People from around the world sent in their best wishes for the wife of the late Billy Brown. She's extremely popular and thanks to the internet, people thousands of miles away can keep up with their favorite reality TV stars. Are you glad to hear that Amy Brown is well on the mend now? Shout out in the comments below and come back here for all your Alaskan Bush People news.